What I did with the Wiz, which very few people know, because the only way you would know it is if I explained it to you, and the few people who would intuit it are in Chicago. What I did with the Wiz was take all of that energy from Alexander, the unconquerable ruler of the sixth dimension that New York never experienced and invested it in the Wiz, in Mr. Wiz. Because it wasn't on anybody's menu. The idea of the wizard was inspired by the character from the Judy Garland film. A wizened old guy who was a charlatan selling snake oil. But when I got the gig, they knew that wasn't going to work. But where were we headed? I knew. I knew the Wiz had to be superhuman. I'm glad you asked me that question because someday someone's going to write a dissertation <clears throat> about the evolution of that character, especially since Richard Pryor played that character in the film and Queen Latifah played that character in the television version. You're welcome. No, I don't mind making work for other celebrities. So therein lies a series of connections for someone who is cerebrally aroused about what this character means. But if you look at, if you look at me in full makeup and costume, I look like one of the superheroes in films now. But no one could even envision that then. <laughs>